Okay, so in this video, we'll be drawing the cross-section view of a road. And for this approach, I'm going to use the same application, which is known by SWDTM. It's free, just download it. Download link is down below in the video description. Okay, so as you can see, I got data in the same format, which is change, offsets, and then elevations. In offsets, if you see, zero is for center line, minus two, minus four, and minus six are offsets for left side, and then two, four, and six are for right side. Then if you see, the changes are zero, 100, 200, and then 300, which means we have only four cross sections data which needs to be plotted. All right, now let's plot them. First of all, select your data, then double click on SWDTM application. From the same toolbar, click cross sections, draw long profile or cross section, and then click draw cross sections. A dialog box appeared where I'm going to select from Excel file as read file. In change options, I'm happy with include all changes because I want to plot all the cross sections data. Okay, you can of course control the section view by changing these parameters. I'm happy with the default values, and of course, you can just change these guys. Okay, just in order to control the cross section view. When I'm done with that, I'll just click execute. And if you see a nice message, just telling you that four sections are ready to be plotted. Just navigate your AutoCAD. Now click draw all, and then click anywhere in AutoCAD working area. And that's nicely done. That means SWDTM works. As you can see all the four cross sections are been plotted.